also when you look at but then you can also go and say but look look at the turnout look at the amount of people that are that are watching like you know when it comes to the big games yeah the big games there's a decent turnout but yeah, your, yeah, yeah, no, your average be... women's super league game you're not getting decent numbers you know what i mean so i can see why because you've got people like what is it alex scott you know the one that used to play for arsenal uh is that her name yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you see her, someone like her, she's got the credentials. I'll give it to her. She can come, she can sit next to the man them and talk on football and stuff can't like sit, that. Can't but sit like Henri. Yeah, go on. She can't sit next to Henri. Okay. She can't sit next to Paul Mercer. She can't sit next to Rio. She can't sit next to Paul Scholes. She can't sit next to them. That is impossible. How? Where? When? No, but they need to these be put on some playing. sort of a platform, though. Because... These girls was playing, and they wasn't even on Sky. <laughs> they wasn't. That's not even a joke. I'm not even looking to make jokes. When these girls was playing, like, they were hardly on Sky Sports. They were hardly. Like, they was to the tail end, and then the women's football kind of, like, elevated, and, you know, you, you now they've got women's league and rare. Am I chatting crap? No, nah, you're not. You're not. You're not. About to say. So where now does it? They get the flipping, the push to say, yeah, they're sitting beside <coughs> Jermaine Defoe. They're sitting beside Roy King. What? So are you upset because you wanted to sit next to no, Jermaine Defoe? No, 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 no. Don't get it twisted. I don't want nothing. Uh-huh. To, I don't want nothing to do with football. Don't get it twisted. It's not even that. Never has. Never will be. Mm, okay, okay. So, but um, but then you need to look at it on the other like on the other, like because come on, they're giving these women a platform. They they're getting their name out there. Don't get me wrong. The new Champions League thing. They've added a woman now. I've never really heard of her. She's a nice lady. Um, the the mixed race lady. Um, I don't know what her name is. Uh, she's with um Michael Richards and Jamie Carragher and Thierry Henry. She does the Champions League nights. I don't know if it's on. But she's BT. a presenter. She presents. Yeah. That's okay. Okay. That there's there's, there's So you're talk, you're not, basically I'm, talking about no. people like Alex uh, Alex Scott, um Bro, all the all, all these women that are, you know, they're now standing, they're doing the, the, the punditry, they're doing the half time talks or the full time talks at the stadium right. on the pitch and all that. You're talking about those people. Who are doing the commentary and stuff like that? Yeah, and who's in? Yeah, and who are in the like the studio talking on the game and this that and the other? Listen, you see, for presenting, I would say the same. If there was a man in there and he ain't done nothing, but he's talking and he's talking alongside Rio and he's talking alongside Jamie Redknapp and Roy Keane. No, no, but oh, yeah, they would do that, of course. Yeah, they would do it. But I feel the same way towards them as I would do towards the girls. Mm. It's okay presenting and not being nobody. Or whatever. Do you understand what I'm saying? But mm. to actually sit down there and talk football. You're saying that they, they, they ain't got the minerals for it. it? Not even... No, no. Don't try. <laughs> 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 nah, 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 nah. They ain't got the credentials. Okay. So they ain't got the credentials to be talking on another another man playing playing ball. Well, I see no, no, you happen. know what? I hear it. I hear it. I do hear it. I do hear it. So, what is your opinion on the the, the Chelsea women's um, manager? That was, I think, she was rumored to get a job in the men's game because yeah, they, we'll... I think, they've been forcing this for for quite a while now. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. What What is your honest opinion on that? You give me your honest take on that. Well, it, ain't gonna, it, ain't, it won't really work, would it? <laughs> no, you never know. I get it. You ever been here? Room. Ever... You have you ever you ever been in a dressing room? No, nah, listen, I know, I know, I know. All right. Listen, I know. But do you tell me how it wouldn't work though? You tell me how you think it wouldn't work. I just don't think I just don't think the lads would take it serious. But I'm lying. Okay. Do you reckon do you reckon that um she'd be able to handle it? Like a lot of the um, you know, like the environment, how it gets. You know, like when you're losing as well and the fans are against you and, you know, you're trying to get the three points, you're trying to get Sutton out of the game and, you know, you got the lino and all of that stressing you out. Then you've got the, the, you know, the away management team and that they're trying to get at you. Do you think that, do you reckon she'll handle all of that? Well, time will tell because it's going to happen, isn't it? 
<laughs> yeah, no, no, it is. I think it will. It's gonna happen because they've been they're... trying to force this agenda. Yeah, to be honest, I ain't got a problem with it. Me personally, they're... they'll push it, but they'll see it won't work. Mm. So, would we'll, like I said, time will tell. They'll see. Do you reckon? Do you reckon the uh, a women's all star team would be able to beat uh, a men's team? Well, you we, we, you already had this. If if they was to get the best women around the world, put them in one team, and play an average men's team, do you reckon well, they would beat them? You had the American team, American national girls team, who played the American national boys under fifteens, and they got beat seven nil. <laughs> okay. But if they was to get the best women from all over the world, I know USA, they won the World Cup, I get it. And, you know, they was demanding to get equal pay, um, you know, than the, the men's World Cup winners. Um, now, you know what? What is your take on that? What is your take on that? Them demanding equal pay. Say what? What is your what is your opinion on the women demanding equal pay? The the the, the USA women that won the oh bouncer bouncer's coming. Okay, um, what is your opinion on the 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 USA women's team demanding equal pay as the men for winning the World Cup? But, but they got equal pay in it. Did yeah, they, they did they end up getting it? Yeah, I think they got it the other day. Okay, so what 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 is your thoughts on that? Well, they play to them, innit? Like, what, what, do you know what I mean? What, what, what do you want me to say? They, they hustled their way into the thing, like you know what I mean? They, 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 you know, they work, they work their stuff. I mean, they won the World Cup, so they got something, they got something to go off. Mm. So, do you reckon? Do you reckon that they should uh, deserve that though? Yo, be honest here. Come on, Leon. Be honest. Do you honestly think that they deserve to win or, or to, to 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 get equal pay as the men's for winning the World Cup? The Women's World Cup. Be honest here. What do you mean, be honest, bro? I just said that they done their thing. The men was also, a, like, for giving them equal pay. So, mm. like, but if you got pushing, the men pushing for it and the women pushing for it, you know, it's good. It, the result's always going to be a W for the women, so. Mm. Okay, so from, from, from now on going, do you reckon that, Premier League clubs, they should be paying, um, you know, their their women's side equally. Come on, bruv, man. Like, what are we doing there, bruv? <laughs> no, no, I'm just asking you. We want your honest take on it, yeah, innit? Bruv, that's, that's nonsense. Like, come on, man. So what would you do if you was in charge of the women's game? What would you do? Try and elevate the game to a standard. That's very, very good. Mm. And that's what they're trying to do now. Okay. Okay. Cool. Cool. All right. So, everyone, retweet this space. Tweet all your thoughts on the hashtag.